Hello, this is my first vlog for my adventure slash holiday slash whatever this is going to be um, after a 14 hour flight. I do not look pretty. My hair looks terrible. I don't smell terribly well. I think I need to go find, there's some Eddie had lounge somewhere which I think has um, some showers and stuff and free booze. So maybe I'll go there in a minute. Mind you, it's like 20 past 7 in the morning right now. But hey, it's afternoon in Australian time, so it's able to drink anywhere. So I've managed to log into the free internet, but um, I can't access my emails, which is a little bit annoying because I was going to try and meet mum, Adam, from Midsummer, who is uh, in Doha, which is like a 45 minute air flight. Um, so hopefully if Adam reads this, or watches this, he'll be able to see that I can't access the emails. Um, I also can't access Manhunt or Grinder on my phone, so uh, that's a little bit dodgy. Mind you, I think, isn't gay being illegal here? I'm not sure. I'm in um, the United Emirate, Emirates or whatever it is. Um, I'm also near a children's play area, which I probably shouldn't really be videoing now. But anyway, I've managed to find a quiet spot to do this. Um, now, a lot of people say that I like drama, but it's not as if I cause it myself. Um, I managed to get on a flight today, uh, or yesterday, but the thing was my, um, I didn't really look at what my boarding pass says. Um, it said I was leaving Melbourne, but I was in Sydney. Um, sorry Pip, if you're watching this, it's probably my fault that I didn't tell you that it was Sydney that I was supposed to be flying out of. Anyway, I probably should have looked at the itinerary. I didn't even look at it when I got to the airport. The woman just looked at it and said, um, this says Melbourne, you're in Sydney. And I kind of majorly freaked out and it was like I was off like some episode of airport. Um, and I said to her, I said to the woman at the desk, I was like, oh, it feels like I'm in some kind of episode of airport. And she's like, uh, welcome to my life. So anyway, she wasn't too impressed, but she managed to put me on a flight. Luckily, um, there was a flight to Abu Dhabi leaving like an hour before there was one leaving in Melbourne. So if I had been any, if I had have been any later to the airport, then I would have completely missed that flight as well. And they didn't even charge me extra for it. So I was really lucky, um, lucky. So, um, so I managed to get on a flight. There were so many kids on it. There was a kid behind me that was screaming the whole time, especially when I was trying to, um, trying to sleep. Which I did manage to get some sleep, which was, that was good. Um, so anyway, I'm here now and I've got like five hours to wait until my flight to Frankfurt. Um, so uh, hopefully I can kill some time then. Um, so yeah, I'll go to Frankfurt today um, and I'll get there at like six o'clock German, like German time, at uh, Frankfurt time. And then I go to Berlin straight tomorrow. Because I've always wanted to go to Berlin, so I thought, well, I'll stay there first. Um, I'm staying in a gay hostel for the first five days because um, living in Batemans Bay for two weeks um, has kind of killed me because there are no gays around. So um, I'm going to try and make up for my gay exposure time by staying in a gay hostel. Um, my next blog will probably, I'm not looking at my watch, my next blog will probably be over the weekend or maybe like early next week, depending on like how much I have to say. Um, there also happens to be a huge gay festival in Berlin over the weekend, so I kind of timed that really well. Coincidence, I reckon. Um, but anyway, if, if you're bored, uh, check out, like, just Google search gay hostel in Berlin and it will come up. It, the photos just look like it's straight off a homemade porn movie, um, so it should be interesting. They also have an age limit. Like, everyone has to be less than 36, so that should prove to be quite interesting as well. Um, anyway, I'll keep these short, but um, oh, four minutes? That's a little bit long. I'll try and keep them up, like, a little bit shorter than this, especially considering I haven't really done anything like yet, and it's only been, like, not even a day since I left the country. Um, anyway, so hopefully I will do another vlog next week, um, and I think I need a drink already. Um, anyway, um, love you all. Talk to you later. Bye.